Todd Hutchins new secret weapon that's going to give him infinite power, infinite stamina. Cotton candy, sweetie, go. Let me see that Tootsie Roll. Tootsie Dot. This is Sparta! Todd Hutchins and Michael Todd. It's going to be an awesome match. Um, there's going to be a lot of hype going into it. I mean, Todd Hutchins is on an absolute tear right now. He's dominating everyone. Michael Todd's on a downward spiral. He's out on a three-match losing streak. If he loses to Todd Hutchins, that's four. And I'm telling you right now, Todd Hutchins will beat Monster Michael Todd. And it comes down to a few factors. Factor number one, and to me, the most important factor, is having confidence in yourself. When you're winning and you're dominating everyone, you have so much confidence and that does so much for you when you go up to the table. Michael Todd, he may put on a front right now, but that man does not have any confidence. He got destroyed 6-0-11, got destroyed by Gennady 6-0. He had a war with Ray Vaz. Ray Vaz, a man who hasn't arm wrestled in four years. Ray Vaz, a man who trained for three months, took Michael Todd to the brink and ended up winning, even though arguably some people say Todd won because of the pin. But if you look at the Ray Vaz match, Michael Todd did not win any of the rounds through a pin. He won the rounds through fouls and Ray Vaz conceded in round one to conserve his energy. Michael Todd has not looked good, and Michael Todd may put on a front, but he does not have any confidence in this match. Now, what I think is going to happen in the match is round one, Todd Hutchins will win, and I think as soon as Michael Todd loses round one, all his confidence is going to go out the window and he's going to have an adrenaline dump and he's going to i think i just think psychologically michael todd is not in a good place right now to beat todd hutchins um even though todd hutchins is a smaller man by 30 35 pounds i think he's going to pull it out and he's going to continue his huge winning streak also i think this is lose lose for monster michael todd it's lose lose because if he wins everyone's going to say oh we expect you to win you weigh 35 pounds more you're you're facing a light Heavyweight, you're in the super heavyweights. If he loses, he's going to get crushed for losing to the smaller man. It's lose lose for Monster. Um, now, all Todd Todd Hutchins has to be able to beat the press by Monster. Monster is going to go to defensive, and he's going to go into the from the, he's going to go into the defensive press when he's in the Kings, and he's able to press forward. If Todd Hutchins stops Michael's press, he will win, no questions asked. And if you check out Todd Hutchins' training videos. He is specifically training to beat Monster Michael Todd and to beat that to counteract the down pressure with up pressure. And I the think he's going to do it. And I think it's going to come down to confidence. And that's going to be such a huge factor. Because I think if you watch the match, Michael loses that first round. He's going to lose all his confidence. And that's what we're paying attention to. Now, if Michael is able to keep his composure when he loses, if he loses that first round, Michael could win. I'm a fan of both dudes. I know I give Michael Todd a hard time, but I do respect him. He's a good arm wrestler. It sucks he's on the losing streak. I think he should just be trying to get back on the winning streak by beating heavyweights, not facing a smaller man. But I think best of five, Todd Hutchins will win three to two. That's my prediction. Let me know who y'all think is going to win in the comments. I appreciate y'all stopping by Grip and Rip. Y'all stay strong and have a good one. Peace.